Hello guys, welcome to another exciting episode of NX Daily Top 5 Tech. At number 5, NX brings to you the new Apple iPhone XR specs, the budget-friendly beast. Here's a question, now how much do you care about the display on your phone? Take a moment and really consider it. If you were to put a narrow amount on it, how much would having a perfect smartphone screen worth to you? Apple has an answer and it's 90,000 Naira. That's the price difference between the new iPhone XR and Apple's top-of-the-line iPhone XS. It's the price difference between the XR's 6.1-inch Liquid Retina LCD screen and the 5.8-inch OLED screens on the XS. Apart from the display, the XR and the XS are far more similar than not. They share the same A12 Bionic processors, main cameras with Smart HDR, iOS 12, gesture controls, wireless charging capabilities, and even the forthcoming dual SIM support. And this phone is available for the sale for 275,000 Naira. Budget or not, we think this phone is overpriced. At number 4, Google Play is upgrading your movie purchases to 4K for free. Google announced in a blog post that Google Play customers will see several upgrades to their movie watching experience. Any movies you've previously purchased in SD or HD that are available in 4K will now be automatically upgraded to stream in 4K. If you open the Play Movies and TV app, it should tell you which titles have had the upgrade applied. Additionally, Google Play has lowered the cost of most 4K titles. Lastly, Google has expanded device support for watching titles in 4K with Play Movies and TV app. Now, in addition to working with 4K Sony Bravia TVs, it also works with most 4K Samsung Smart TVs. The company also says it's working on adding support for LG TVs. At number 3, Misfit's new smartwatch, Arts NFC and standalone GPS. After the delayed and drawn-out launch of its first touchscreen smartwatch last year, Misfit is back with its successor. The company announced the Vapor 2 today, which will be available soon for around 90,000 Naira. Not much has changed from the first model, except this version supports NFC and its display features slightly more pixels per inch. It also includes a standalone GPS versus one that required a smartphone connection. The new watch now comes in multiple sizes from the range of 41mm and 46mm, compared to last year's 44mm. Almost everything else about the watch is the same. It still features an AMO LED touchscreen, runs Wear OS, it also features a Qualcomm Snapdragon Wear 2100 processor, includes a heart rate monitor, and has Google Assistant built in it. At number 2, Apple confirms that iOS 12.1 improves selfie quality on the iPhone XS and XR. Ever since the iPhone XS came out, there's been criticism of its front camera specifically that it overly smooths the skin. These, of course, was dubbed Beauty Gate in reference to Samsung-style beautification filters, which Apple has always insisted it doesn't use. Whatever the case, it was definitely there, but now it's going away. During our iPhone XR review, Apple reported that iOS 12.1 will fix a bug in its smart HDR camera system that resulted in smoother-looking photos taken by the front camera on the iPhone XS and XR. At number 1, Qualcomm announces Snapdragon 675 with faster cores and triple camera support. Qualcomm has announced the Snapdragon 675, a mid-range smartphone SoC with some high-end features. Perhaps most notable is the fact that its new Creo 460 architecture is built around ARM's A76 cores, which are designed for flagship devices and haven't yet made their way into Qualcomm chip. The Snapdragon 675 has two performance-focused cores at 2.0 GHz alongside six 1.78 GHz cores designed for power efficiency. For comparison, the current flagship Snapdragon 845 uses four 2.8 GHz performance cores based on the Cortex-A75, so it will still be a lot faster. The 845 is also built on a 10mm process versus the 675's 11mm, but it's unusual to see Qualcomm launch a new CPU design on a mid-range product, particularly considering that the result will probably outperform the ostensibly higher tier Snapdragon 710. And that's it on NX Daily Top 5 Tech. For this and more, follow us on all social media platforms at Nigeria Extreme, and you can visit our website at www.nigeria.tv.